Hi, James Clark, Broker Century 21, Alton Clark, Fine Homes and Estates, here with a quick market update for the luxury sector, both nationwide and here in the state of Florida. So really quick, nationwide, things are looking pretty good. The luxury sector is, is holding pretty steady. Now, I will tell you, inventory is up pretty drastically, almost 50%. Days on market is up slightly. Now, markets with the highest median sales price, <laughs> some of the usuals, Vail, Los Angeles, Beach Cities, Paradise Valley, uh, things of that nature. Um, markets with the highest sales ratio, meaning where are the most homes being sold? Baltimore City, Howard County, Maryland, East Bay, Central Connecticut. So a little bit uh, of an interesting dynamic there. Now let's move into Orlando uh, proper. Here in Orlando, we mirror nationwide inventory increase 51%. That's pretty seismic. Sales price has been pretty flat. Um, price per square foot also flat, meaning we're not seeing increases month over month or year over year, but the days on market is up 47%. So things are still selling. Um, however, and the values are still holding, but there's more inventory that's hitting the market. And that, that means it's taking more and more time. And I can tell you this, a pretty unique anomaly that I'm here, seeing here in central Florida is we're starting to see some really low ball offers in the luxury sector, like offers 10 and 20 plus percent below value. So that's an interesting trend. We'll see if that's something that's just temporary, but I just wanted to share that with you. So translation, both nationwide and here in Central Florida, values are still holding well in the luxury sector. However, inventory is on the rise. We will see what the long-term effects of that is for future home buyers and sellers in the luxury sector. Stay tuned for next month.